I should see roughly one quarter of a volt for every two revolutions per second. Hey guys, it's Scott Meek with Diesel Training. I've had a lot of people ask us recently, how do we troubleshoot an ABS wheel speed sensor? We just need to use resistance, right Scott? The answer to that is actually no. There's two different values or measurements that we need to take to troubleshoot an ABS wheel speed sensor. Now, if you've come to our content before and you enjoy what you see, please remember to like, subscribe, leave some comments down below, let us know what you think. If there's anything you want to know more about, please let us know. Now, moving back to that ABS wheel speed sensor, what are some tools you need in order to do an ABS wheel speed sensor check? Well, you need a jack. You need to be able to lift up the wheel with the ABS sensor that's in question so we can get it off the ground and we're able to spin it by hand. The next tool that you'll need will be a digital multimeter. You're going to need to measure two values. You're going to need to measure resistance, but then you're also going to need to measure voltage, but not DC voltage, AC voltage. So in order to run this test, we've got the wheel lifted up off the ground. I'm going to connect across my ABS wheel speed sensor, and first I'm going to measure my resistance value, which should be somewhere between 1,500 and 2,500 ohms of resistance. Once we have the sensor unplugged, we're going to take terminal test leads so we can get a good, nice fit on those Deutz pins. Now, we're going to turn our multimeter to the resistance setting. As you see here, I have 1.748 K ohm, which means 1,748 ohms of resistance. That is in spec. That is between 1,500 and 2,500. Now, I need to turn my multimeter to voltage AC. When I turn my multimeter to voltage AC and I start to spin this wheel, I should see roughly one quarter of a volt for every two revolutions per second. So I'm going to begin by spinning the tire slowly and monitor that I'm actually seeing the change. So right now I'm at about 160 to 200, I'm roughly 250 millivolts right now, which is one quarter of a volt. As I continue spinning this wheel faster and faster and faster, I should start seeing that voltage increase. Right now I'm putting out around five tenths of a volt. That is in spec. Now all you need to do to test all your other ABS wheel speed sensors would be that same test to verify that the sensor is in fact connected internally through resistance and is also creating the correct voltage which is again one quarter of a volt for every two RPMs. So if this has been helpful for you be sure to press that like button, comment down below if this was helpful or anything else that you might want to learn about in the future in a tech tip, leave that in the comment box and let us know and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for coming and joining us at Diesel Training. We'll see you next time.